this is the this is the system that you said you you got off of the stingy sailor. I don't know what that means. I may make this shorter so yeah. it lets out. Okay. Is that something we need to test first on a yeah, sale we'll or? So this block right here is new. I guess it's called a block. But that's the new one that we got at West Marine. All the other ones came with the boat or they came with the guy that sold us all the used stuff in the plant. That's the piece that broke, but obviously it was way smaller than this one. We put a big monster. And we now have, all of this is new. Well, not new new. A lot of the stuff we already had, the materials or whatever, but we bought a couple of things. But the more expensive stuff, like the blocks, we pretty much had all of them except for this one. This one's new. And the line is new, this metal line. But, so we have a new backstay system. What are you gonna vacuum all the metal stuff shavings? Oh, you brought the floor? Where's the floor? Oh, you already brought it? We're we're carpeting our living room. Ooh, there's some water in there. I really wonder where it's coming in from. It's coming in right here. But I thought we had duct tape. Yeah, we put white duct tape. It doesn't matter. Wind's blowing it in. I mean, I hope it is coming from there. I hope it's not coming from the bottom of the boat. You know what I mean? Vacuuming the boat. Oh, and we brought our new used bimini. I shouldn't really say used, I don't think. This we got from the gentleman that we bought our sailboat from. We initially had said no, we didn't want it because we were gonna just use a tarp over the boom or nothing at all. We don't want it to block the view of the sails when we have it open, but we decided after much, much, much sun and a lot of sunburns that we contacted. Paint it? Yeah. See all the cracks? I mean, are you painting it to protect from water entry or painting it to make it pretty and then laying root flooring over it, which is gonna cover the paint anyway? So what's the paint for? Prettiness or? It's got drainage. So you got drainage there. Yeah, so I gotta cut a hole there. So I just need to roll it out. I should have. Would you like me to get it? I don't know what that. I want to know what the name of this boat is to see if they have a YouTube channel. They're sitting in it right now. I don't want to bother them. They look like they were eating lunch, but I think they live on it. I could live very, very, very comfortably on that. Nice. I don't know if I could park it, <laughs> but I could live in it. Remember this or write it down in your little sticky note? I'm videotaping right now, so we just listen to the video. 23 and a quarter. About 21. Between the 23 and a quarter by 21. Okay. okay. By 71 and a half. 71 and a half, exactly. 71 and a half. Turn that, cause yeah, cause I can see it's all wet right there. Turn that thing upside down. So it's turning it all black. You just got done sanding it and fixing it. And it's already turning black. Okay. Is that something that, did you bring any of the white Uzi stuff? Yeah, but that, see this one's not leaking, but that one is. So we can put Uzi stuff around the nut. You gotta take it out and put the Uzi stuff around it. This okay. side's not doing it. It's just that side. That's fine. Let's go. So let's, let's do one project at a exactly, time. Exactly, so let's cut that first. Put that wet thing in the sun so it dries out.
wasted. The other side is the right side? No, this is our, it's just it would have, we would have wasted that much of it by putting it down like that. Mm -hmm. Do we yeah. need to make little holes at the end so the yeah. weep thing yeah, still works? Oh. I want to make it make sure it's the right thing. Do we want to make the holes with the razor or with the drill so they're circular? First off, I need to get this straight. I mean, it just needs to lay. If you give it maybe half an hour while you do something else, the sun will heat it up and get it flat. So Donovan found this stuff on Amazon, some sort of a boat deck, cushy. So thickness wise, it's like this thick. Here's a leftover piece and it's got white. You peel this white paper off and then you stick it. And then we cut out holes over here for the grubber holes, whatever they're called. And now we're measuring a piece to put in there. If we have enough left over. Oh, that feels good. <laughs> does it? You're such a nerd. It does. It feels good. That's how you enter. You follow the path like an entrance. You follow the yellow brick road. Well, it's not a brick road. So the other ones have to be straight. Well, yeah, it needs to be because that's the way the yellow brick road goes straight. So I think I like it like that. If, it, if the lines would have been straight, straight, it would have looked awkward. Okay. I like it like this. Pretty cute. How much do they sell it for? We don't even know if that one works. It does. It does? I don't know if it works now. Well, that's what I meant. We don't know if it works because I slammed the pop top on top of it. We have carpet in our boat. That's the one that's leaking. It's turned too much. That's a big old nut. Oh, that's a pretty picture. stuff under here? No. Okay. So it's not going to leak anymore? Whatever no, you... Not. What are we doing in here? This is the power. That hose is... is terrible. That hose does... It's so hard. It's hard as a rock. That hose. That old one? This oh, green hose. It doesn't bend at all. 
Where's the water gonna go to? That's where I need it. We need to find a way to. Where's the uh, the hole? Is it? Come, There's come, only one hole. Is it? Does it? That's what sits down in it and sucks it up. Okay. Okay. There's supposed to be a switch that our float. Let me see. There's a float for it. Hold on. This is supposed to mount on the thing. So this is the float. So when it gets to a certain point, it kicks on. Okay. Um, so this goes in here, and when the water gets to a certain point, it kicks on. Right. Well, the water goes in here, and right. then where does it come out of? Right. This has got to connect to another pipe. That's the thing. It's got to connect to this pipe, and I don't have it right there. See how that, that pipe goes in there. I bet that board's gotten wet in there. Oh, I didn't even know that stuff was in there. What? Whatever's in there. That's the board that was right here. Yeah, but there's two metal sticks. Yeah, there's two metal sticks. One of them is the Genoa the whisker pole, and the other one is, uh, actually, I, I, I cleaned this up. It's a screw. Is the fishing pole still in there? Oh, uh, yeah. yeah, it's still in there. We got a fishing pole in our boat. All right, there's a, I think the hand crank is in, in over there. Okay, what are you gonna do? I'm gonna get it and stick that into the water. Okay? Okay. Let me disconnect this because this isn't this is not working right now because I need to get it. I need a switch for it. Okay, ready? Yep. It's almost like a toilet plunger. Well, same thing pretty much. We need some sort of a connection to add to this thing that uh, has like a, uh, a, a screw in tight. You need something like more bendable and flexible. You need something like this so you can connect it to it's exactly what it is. Or, oh, I didn't think about that. What? No, that's not going to work. Well, this is supposed to suck it up, right? Yeah, but where's the water going to go? It's going to go out. Let's see if it works. Do I still need to pump the no, little thing? This is going to pump it into that area. I don't think it's turned on. Because earlier when you were messing with this, you flipped a switch on that thing. This is wired directly to it. Oh. So that's what I'm saying. It should be working. Because this is your, that's your positive. I made a noise when you plugged it into the other one. I know. And this is the new battery. Let's see which solar panel this is. No, obviously working. The solar panel is not charging it. Oh, no wonder that's plugged in directly to that other one. <laughs> I just, I just did that. What are you doing? Let me get the battery out of there. Because of this cord, the cable's too big. So we need this right here. You want me to take that out? Yeah, just take it out and put it in there. That's crazy, that battery's nine years old and it still works. What's the measurement? 23 and 5 sixteenths. 23 and 5 sixteenths. So this all came from the guy in Atlanta and we buffed it up. Well, we. <laughs> you buffed it. It looks brand spanking new. And then we can take this one back and buff it. Genius. We're slowly but surely redoing the entire boat off of that guy's <laughs> parts. Some of the stuff ours is in better shape though. Whipping line. That looks very nice. Very cool. 
You're gonna do this to both ends, I assume? Yeah, I'm trying to look and see if there's a different way to put this. I was thinking. Uh-oh. See how you can do lines like, you can connect this line to this. Mm-hmm. You have to, if I don't have that tool though, you have to have a thing to go in there. Yeah. Stick it in there, but. That's it, how the they came at West Marine, the ones that we bought to put on the Right. What you have to do is you have, to, you have to do like this, pull out the center part, and then run this through there, and then twine it together. Ooh. Yeah, I know. It's, it's, there's another video on that. Just to think about it. I said one day, let's get a sailboat, and you looked at me like I was crazy. And look yeah, at all the fun see, you're having. This is fun, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the fun you're having. This line. You've worked on the sailboat all day today fixing stuff, and then you come home, eat dinner, happens? and work on it again. Because of the center part? Yeah. See, that's, that's what I'm trying to I'm not gonna cut the rest of it. Perfect. Everything's always perfect. So you're doing all of that with just one needle? Mm -hmm. Now you get it. The center won't come out. Because it's, you see how you try it through there and it holds it in place. Yeah. Now pull on it. Now just try. Pull my finger? No. I can't pull if you let go. You can pull it apart because you got all those flying going through and hold it in place. And where's the, what's this called? New England ropes. Whipping, whipping line. Whipping line. Whipping line. Whip it, whip it, whip some ass. What's going on, sick little puppy? Yeah, it's called what? Bowline? Bowline. Bowline. Can you make it up? Do what? Jump up. A sick little girl. No, it's not sailboat related. No, you have to sit there, spin it, spin it. You're watching. I'm videotaping. I've got six minutes so far. I'm gonna have to cut and splice it a little bit, otherwise, we're gonna lose some viewership. <laughs> Oi, watch your finger. go back through and then you go around and then you're gonna make two you make two two, two passes 